Eight reactions you won't believe when Sigma males get angry. Assuming that every angry reaction is the same is the biggest error you can make. Everybody experiences anger differently, but what really distinguishes us is how we respond to it. Welcome to the intriguing realm of Sigma males, those introverted, self-reliant individuals who sidestep the traditional social hierarchy. These enigmatic figures are not easily provoked, but when they do get angry, their reactions can be quite surprising. From silent treatments to unseen storms, let's embark on an enlightening journey into the world of Sigma males and their unique ways of expressing anger. Let's dive into the surprising world of Sigma males and their anger responses. Firstly, when Sigma males get angry, they often retreat into silence. Now, this might seem counterintuitive to some, because in a world that's all about expressing oneself, silence can be disconcerting. But for Sigma males, it's their go-to response when things get heated. Let's delve deeper into this. Sigma males are known for their introspective nature. They are the ones who prefer to observe and understand rather than react impulsively. When anger strikes, they don't let it take the steering wheel. Instead, they retreat into their shells, creating a buffer zone between themselves and the source of their frustration. This act of withdrawing is not a sign of weakness or avoidance, but rather a conscious choice to prevent any rash decisions or hurtful words. Silence for a Sigma male serves two purposes. On one hand, it acts as a personal fortress, a safe space where they can process their emotions without external influence. It's a period of introspection where they analyze what sparked the anger and how best to address it. On the other hand, it's also a signal to the outside world, a clear, albeit silent, message that they are not in a state to engage. But here's the tricky part. This silent treatment can be confusing, even frustrating for those on the receiving end. It's like running into a brick wall in the middle of a conversation. The sudden silence can be misinterpreted as indifference or even arrogance, but that's far from the truth. In reality, it is a sign of respect. A Sigma male chooses silence over saying something in anger that they might regret later. In the heat of the moment, it's easy to let anger dictate our actions. But Sigma males take a different approach. They choose silence. They choose introspection. They choose respect. So next time you encounter a Sigma male who's gone silent, remember it's not a snub. It's their way of dealing with anger. Silence for a Sigma male is a powerful tool of expression. It's their silent roar, their unspoken dialogue, their way of saying, I'm angry, but I won't let it control me. Secondly, Sigma males turn to analysis when they're upset. Now, this sounds quite logical, doesn't it? But let's delve deeper to understand this characteristic reaction. Sigma males, you see, are the Sherlock Holmes of personality types. They're introspective, meticulous, and always game for a cerebral challenge. So, when anger strikes, they don't lash out or retreat into a shell. Instead, they channel their inner detective and start piecing together the puzzle. Imagine a situation that has sparked anger in a Sigma male. He won't simply stew in his rage or let his emotions run wild. Oh no, he'll start dissecting the event bit by bit, like a seasoned investigator at a crime scene. He'll look for patterns, try to figure out what exactly triggered his anger and why. He'll question every detail and analyze every angle. But the analytical approach of a Sigma male is not limited to understanding the what and why of the situation. They also focus on the how, how did they react? How could they have responded differently? How can they prevent such a situation from recurring? They constantly seek answers and they don't rest until they have them all. It's not that Sigma males enjoy being angry, quite the contrary. They view anger as an unwelcome disruption, a glitch in their otherwise smooth operation. So they treat it as they would any other problem, with logic, analysis, and a determination to fix it. And the most remarkable part, they do all this in their heads. They don't seek external validation or advice. Their analysis is deeply personal, and they prefer to keep it that way. It's like they're playing a game of chess against their own emotions, strategizing and planning their next move in complete silence. But remember, this analytical approach doesn't make them cold or unfeeling. It's just their way of navigating through the stormy seas of anger, steering their ship with the compass of logic and reason. Anger to a Sigma male is a problem to be solved, and solve it they will, in their uniquely analytical, introspective way. They'll emerge on the other side with valuable insights, a clearer understanding of themselves, and a plan to avoid such triggers in the future. Now, isn't that a fascinating way to handle anger? 
Thirdly, when Sigma males get angry, they hide their turmoil. It's a fascinating trait, isn't it? This isn't to say that they don't feel anger, but rather they are masters at maintaining a calm exterior. Like an enigmatic magician, they have an uncanny ability to keep their emotions under wraps, never letting the world catch a glimpse of the storm brewing inside them. Picture a serene lake, placid and calm on the surface, but beneath, there could be a whirlpool of activity, hidden from view. That's our Sigma male for you. He could be seething with anger, but you'd never know it from his tranquil facade. It's almost as if they have an internal switch, allowing them to maintain a composed exterior while dealing with a tempest of emotions within. What's more, this ability to conceal their anger is not an act of deception, but rather a testament to their self-control. Sigma males are not fond of drama or unnecessary confrontations. They believe in dealing with their anger in a more productive and less destructive manner. They channel their emotions into something constructive, a strategy that often leads to surprising and innovative solutions. Their anger is not a raging fire that consumes everything in its path, but a controlled flame that can be harnessed for a purpose. It's a tool, not a weapon. It's a force that drives them, not a burden that weighs them down. This unique approach to anger is a part of what makes Sigma males so intriguing and difficult to understand. But don't be mistaken, the anger of a Sigma male is not to be taken lightly. Just because it's hidden doesn't mean it's not powerful. Like an unseen storm, it can be ferocious, intense, and overwhelming. However, it's always under their command, never spiraling out of control. So the next time you see a Sigma male seemingly unfazed by a situation that would make most people lose their cool, remember? There's probably a storm raging beneath that calm surface. You just can't see it. A Sigma male's anger is like an unseen storm, powerful but hidden. Fourthly, Sigma males use anger to reflect upon themselves. You see, for the Sigma male, anger isn't just a raw, uncontrolled emotion. It's a sign, a signal, a red light on the dashboard of their psyche saying, hey, something isn't right here. When the Sigma male finds himself grappling with anger, he doesn't lash out or let it consume him. Instead, he takes a step back. He uses this emotion as a mirror, reflecting his internal state back at him. This introspection is a critical part of the Sigma male's response to anger. It's not about blaming others or shying away from the emotion. It's about understanding its roots and origins. Consider anger as a wake-up call for the Sigma male. It's like a knock on the door of his consciousness, prompting him to delve deeper into his thoughts and feelings. It pushes him to question, to probe, to dig beneath the surface. What is causing this anger? Is it a situation, a person, or perhaps a personal shortcoming? By asking these questions, the Sigma male is able to transform his anger from a destructive force into a productive one. He uses it as a tool for self-improvement and growth. You see, for the Sigma male, every experience, every emotion is a lesson, and anger is no different. This self-reflection also helps the Sigma male in addressing the source of his anger. If it's a person or a situation causing this emotion, he can devise strategies to deal with it effectively. If it's a personal shortcoming, he can work on improving it. In either case, the anger serves as a stepping stone, propelling the Sigma male towards betterment. Remember, the Sigma male doesn't let his emotions control him. He controls his emotions. And when anger rears its head, he doesn't shy away from it. Instead, he embraces it using it as a catalyst for self-improvement and growth. So the next time you find yourself grappling with anger, remember the Sigma male. Use this emotion as an opportunity for introspection, self-improvement, and growth. After all, for Sigma males, anger is a catalyst for self-improvement. Fifthly, Sigma males aren't afraid of confrontation when they're angry. Now, this might surprise you considering their preference for solitude and non-confrontational nature. But when a Sigma male's ire is roused, he won't shy away from a direct showdown. Sigma males, in their calm, mysterious demeanor, harbor a strong sense of self-assuredness. This confidence fuels their ability to handle confrontations effectively. Yes, they would rather stay away from drama and unnecessary conflict. But when the situation calls for it, they step up to the plate. Their approach to confrontation is unique, just like their personality. They do not explode in a fit of rage or allow their anger to cloud their judgment. Instead, they take a moment to gather their thoughts and strategize. They consider the best course of action and then act decisively with the intention of resolving the conflict 
not escalating it. Sigma males are rational beings. They understand that anger, when expressed inappropriately, can cause more harm than good. So they choose to communicate their displeasure in a calm, composed manner. They articulate their feelings and thoughts clearly, ensuring that their message is not lost in the heat of the moment. They also listen. Sigma males believe in fair play, even in conflict. They give the other party a chance to voice their side of the story. They listen, analyze, and then respond. This balanced approach often leads to a resolution that is acceptable to both parties. And while they are introverted, Sigma males are not pushovers. They value their peace and will not allow anyone to disrupt it without reason. They stand their ground, defend their boundaries, and demand respect. But they do so in a manner that is firm yet respectful. Sigma males are not ones to hold grudges. Once the confrontation is over, they let go of the anger. They understand that holding on to negativity serves no purpose. Instead, they learn from the experience and move on, stronger and wiser. When pushed too far, Sigma males will stand their ground. They may be quiet and reserved, but they are also strong, resilient, and unafraid to confront when necessary. It's this dynamism that makes the Sigma male an enigma, a force to be reckoned with. Sixthly, Sigma males take time to cool off when they're angry. Have you ever witnessed a kettle boiling over? That's a situation Sigma males strive to avoid at all costs. When anger hits, they often retreat from the source of their ire. This is not an act of cowardice, but a strategic move, a testament to their wisdom and self-control. Imagine a chess player contemplating his next move. That's a Sigma male in the cool-off period. They don't hastily jump into the fray, letting their emotions dictate their actions. Instead, they pause, step back, and give themselves the space to breathe, to evaluate, to cool down. It's like pressing the pause button in the midst of a heated video game battle. This retreat is a self-imposed exile where they regain their composure, recalibrate their thoughts, and diffuse their anger. It's like a pit stop in a race, a necessary pause for refueling and tire changes that ultimately ensures a smoother and safer ride. And it's not just about cooling their jets, it's about understanding why they're overheating in the first place. They explore the depths of their anger, seeking its roots, its triggers. They don't just skim the surface, they dive deep. It's a journey of introspection, a quest for understanding, a pilgrimage to the core of their being. During this cool-off period, they transform their anger into something constructive. It's like a blacksmith turning a raw piece of iron into a useful tool. They harness their anger, shape it, mold it, until it's a tool they can use, not a burden they must bear. And when they finally re-enter the situation, they do so with a clear mind, a calm demeanor, and a thoughtful response. They return not as the knight charging into battle, but as the king strategizing, commanding, reigning in his emotions. A Sigma male knows the value of a cool head in a hot situation. They understand that the power of anger lies not in its release, but in its control. Their cool-off period is not just a break from the heat, but a journey into the cool depths of their mind, a voyage of self-discovery, and self-mastery. Lastly, Sigma males respond to anger rationally, not emotionally. This statement may seem a bit paradoxical since anger is a powerful emotion, but the key here is understanding how Sigma males process and express this emotion. When a Sigma male feels anger, they often retreat into their minds, putting their powerful analytical skills to work. They sift through their feelings, trying to understand where this anger is coming from. Is it justified? Is it reasonable? They question the source of their anger, attempting to break it down to its most fundamental elements. However, they don't stop at understanding the source. They move beyond it, looking for solutions. Sigma males are problem solvers at heart. They don't see any point in giving in to the whirlwind of emotions that anger can stir up. Instead, they seek to fix whatever is causing the anger. And if it can't be fixed, they look for ways to manage it, to minimize its impact. This can sometimes make them seem detached or unemotional, but this couldn't be further from the truth. They feel emotions as deeply as anyone else, but they believe in controlling their emotions, not letting their emotions control them. Sigma males understand that anger, if left unchecked, can lead to impulsive, regrettable actions. They know that it can distort reality, making mountains out of molehills. They are aware that it can damage relationships, create conflict, and stand in the way of resolution. So, they respond to anger rationally. They don't let it cloud their judgment. They don't let it dictate their actions. 
Instead, they use it as a tool, a signal that something needs to change or be addressed. They consider all aspects of the situation, weigh their options, and then decide on the best course of action. In essence, a Sigma male's approach to anger is a reflection of their overall approach to life. They are independent thinkers, introspective and pragmatic. They value reason over reaction, solutions over conflict, and understanding over judgment. A Sigma male's response to anger is as rational as they come. They take this powerful, turbulent emotion and transform it into a force for positive change. That, ladies and gentlemen, is the power of a Sigma male's rational response to anger. So, there you have it. The eight surprising ways Sigma males react when they get angry. From the silent treatment to the rational response, we've seen how these enigmatic individuals navigate through their anger. They analyze, they self-reflect, they confront directly, and they cool off. Each reaction is a unique testament to their independent spirit and self-contained nature. Remember, understanding the Sigma male's anger is a step towards understanding the Sigma male himself.